Hi folks, today we're going to take a look at Pacific Northwest Transparency, where he gets his feelings hurt and thinks the appropriate reaction is to pull out a can of pepper spray. But before we start today's video, as always, a big thank you to all of my current and new channel members and subscribers. Without you guys and your continuous support, I couldn't keep this channel going, so I want to thank all of you personally from the bottom of my heart. If you guys are new to the channel, please subscribe to the page, leave a like and a comment because it really helps me with the algorithm. And if you can, please consider becoming a member. With all that being said, let's enjoy today's video. I'm just curious what you're up to, man. Oh, just out taking pictures. Oh, nice. Nice. Yeah, best not tell them the truth. You know, you don't want to be too transparent and all and admit that you're actually just filming this restaurant because you want to get a reaction from the staff and the customers so you can put it on YouTube for ad revenue. Nothing about the First Amendment. Nothing about your Fourth Amendment. No, this is all about you trying to show us, quote unquote, transparency. What the fuck are you talking about, man? You don't want to be on camera. I would walk up to a camera. Yeah, well, I mean, I don't really give a shit, but there's some employees in there that are feeling really uncomfortable. So, um, yeah. so their feelings are good. Yeah, you're hurting people's feelings. Feelings, okay. yeah. And that's the most important thing, right? Right. Feelings. Yeah, people yeah, people's feelings do matter in this situation because this is a restaurant. People bring their family or their friends here or their significant others. And, well, maybe they don't want to have their children filmed by some weirdo who's trying to make some vague argument that this is about the First Amendment. Now, if those people feel uncomfortable, they'll stop going to that restaurant. If those employees feel uncomfortable coming to work because of your actions, they'll quit and have to find a new employment. And, well, this restaurant then has to suffer. So, yeah, their feelings do matter. Was feeling so you, you don't really care you're just gonna stand here and do it anyway like you're just gonna be a dick or something why would you say that i don't know because it's like can we just have a conversation like what are you doing, what are you doing? yeah okay so what are you doing this like why if somebody doesn't want you to do it why are you doing it anyway if we don't want you to stand out here and film or take photos why are you doing it anyway well because is frankly, there a purpose you're not my boss no um, I'm not married to you. Right. You're not my kid, so I got no need to listen to you about anything. Okay. Hey, that guy's a dick. If you want to get rude. So you just, like, are, like, I don't know, there's some young girls in there, right? We have minors working here who are feeling uncomfortable. Here's so you gotta do. do you mind? Here's what you gotta do. Do what I have to do? Okay, so you're just gonna continue to be an asshole. Uh, dot, 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 yes. I'm gonna continue to take pictures and videos. I'm not gonna be an asshole. Of minors? Like, you're taking pictures of children, employees? Like, what are you taking photos of? Customers? Like, they're feeling uncomfortable as well. I'm taking pictures of everything. But for 
for what? Can you go do it at the Capitol building? Take a picture of those people. You know, like take pictures of something else. Well, today, the lake. Today it's your Today it's McConey's. Today it's your And the young people that are, you know, barista you, you and drip. back to this young people. Well, it's like, there are. That's what I'm, that's why I came out here, though, is because it was like the young girls that were taking orders or whatever that were feeling uncomfortable by whoever was filming. Well, so I don't feeling, really care. You know, don't trump my rights. Right. I don't even care. I could give a shit less. Shenanigans. Na, 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 na. Shenanigans. Na, 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 na. And we're calling shenanigans, folks, because, yes, he is technically correct. Their feelings don't trump his rights. However, their feelings do trump his right to film them and being a dick about it. Because this isn't a government building. This is a restaurant. What does this have to do with anything about exercising your rights? You're harassing these people because why? You know it will get you clicks and views. Now, she brought up a valid point. Why not go to the Capitol building and film? Why not go to a city hall? Why not go to, you know, some government entity? Why harass a private establishment? Because he knows this will get him the views he needs. Because he'll call everybody Karen or Darren or whatever they want to say. Because, well, Florida's have a lack of vocabulary and imagination. It was just like, I'm kind of an adult, so well, I had to... Like, yeah, you came out here and you called me an asshole and a dick. Well, you are being kind of a so dick. So, you can kiss you my know? ass and go back to work. How about that? Yeah, all right. Since you're going to be rude about it. I'm not being rude. I'm, I, I came out here very nicely <laughs> and asked you if you could stop. You have a weird interpretation of yeah. nice. No, it's really not. I, I asked you very kindly at the door. I even, like, chimed in because I thought that the other girl was going to be, like, more rude. So, you know. Now you showed her. I showed her. Yeah, you're showing us. You know, you really got it going on there. Can't wait to see your YouTube video. You should tag me in it. That's really not cool that you're doing something that's making people so uncomfortable. I'm so, I can't hear you. It's really not cool that you're doing something that's making people uncomfortable and you don't care. So I should just my life depending on how other people feel no, I, I can't be here because people are offended like what if people are offended over there where am I allowed to do what I'm doing what are you doing just out taking pictures okay, okay. like that yeah turn about spare place <laughs> hey. okay have a enjoy good day. the same freedoms I am yeah, have a good day you too sideways you get a better view you don't mind your photo taken do you i love it it's just kind of hypocritical when you i know, know isn't it what a bitch i am do you want to take a video do you have anything to say i'm okay. good you don't want to share what you're doing though. ask me a question i want to know what you're doing i'm, I'm taking curious. pictures but of what for what my own purpose translation I want to film people in public and say it's the First Amendment rights that I have just so I can harass and annoy people to make a quick book off of YouTube. It seems like you're videotaping. You have uh, a microphone on? A little bit of both. Yeah. And what? For what? Are you going to like... What are you doing? What? Like, are you... What are you doing? You don't want to share? You don't want to elaborate? I've answered every question you've asked me. I know, but like, what are you taking? more personal than others. Right. So you don't want to answer what you're doing here and you won't tell me your birthday. Once again, I already have. <laughs> What's your zodiac sign? You need 
something. Oh, no, I'm just here hanging in public. I, I prefer not to be on camera. Then you right shouldn't now. have walked out and stood right next to me then. All right. Well, I've... What's your reason for filming, sir? There's two police cameras right here. You're not catching anything that's not on camera. Correct. I mean, I'm not saying you can't. What is your reason for filming? Because people are uncomfortable <laughs> and talking within the places. And I'm saying they're asking me if it's legal because I am impressed with the state. What is your reason for filming? You don't have to have one. I do have one for my own personal reasons. I know, but you're making people really uncomfortable. I'm not saying legally you can't make people uncomfortable, you can't harass people, but you can film all you want. From a public standpoint, yeah. 100%. And I can ask you why you're filming. Yeah. And you don't have to tell me. I'm just out enjoying the day. Yeah, but you have a lot of people, like, people in there asking, should we call the cops? Should we not? Can you get you back? Do you touch oh! me again? You touch me again. I Buddy, shit just went from zero to 100 real fucking quick. Oh. Get back away from me. <laughs> get away from me. Okay. I'm just saying you're making people uncomfortable. Yeah, people like walk up and grab the like property. Shenanigans. Na, 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 na. Shenanigans. Na, 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 na. And we're calling shenanigans yet again. Because it didn't look like from your video that he grabbed your stuff. It even looked like he bumped your stuff. It's like he got a little bit too close to you when he was trying to figure out who you are and why you're doing this. And you overreacted by pulling out your pepper spray. Now... Is it because you're a butt-hurt frauditor or a sensitive little snowflake whose feelings got hurt? But isn't that the truly ironic part? Everyone else's feelings don't matter, but his, oh, he has to protect with himself with a... The business. I'm terrorizing the business? Yes, you are. How is that? Because you're out here harassing us. You're harassing us. You came out stuff. here to me. I didn't come in there to you. You were out here on, like, the business Public. front. Property. Photographing and taking videos of Public minors, property. of minors, of children and Public customers. Property. It's public property. Public property. You face me and I'll kick you right in your bony shins. Boom. Roasted. I'll break that little stick. Yeah. I'd like to see you try. Well, you're definitely in a bigger weight class than I me. I know. I'd fuck you up. For sure. I would. I'd you're making your company look great. Hey, I don't care. I don't care. This What's your name then? Weird. I told you earlier, you can find and find it. Okay. Okay. See? Just like that. Like inappropriate. What? It's inappropriate. Jesus. You gotta get over yourself, girl. No, I don't. Yeah, you, you need to get over yourself. I don't know yourself. who told you you're special, but I'm not why? special. I'm not acting special. I'm working at a sandwich shop. It's not special. You know? That's not, I'm not acting special. And we're going to end it here, folks. We can clearly see this frauditor is a hypocrite, like all frauditors. When someone else's feelings are on the line, or the feelings of the customers or staff of a non-government entity, but a private business wants to be considered, no, there's a bunch of snowflakes and they're a bunch of Karens. But yet, when somebody gets a little too close to him, oh, it's, a, it's an offense worthy of him pulling out pepper spray. So if you guys like this video, please like, share, and subscribe. Leave a thumbs up and a comment because it helps me with the algorithm. And if you can, please consider becoming a member. With all that being said, be well, be safe. And special thanks to all members of the news team. Without your guys' continuous, ongoing support, I couldn't keep the channel going. So I want to thank you all personally from the bottom of my heart.